I have a collection of the worst art hacks that we could find and compile on TikTok. Now, here's the funny disclaimer. It's quite difficult to find bad art hacks on TikTok because of the algorithm on TikTok and the way that it responds to user interactions. You have to really look for bad ones. Most of them are actually like pretty useful, but I wanted to see if with a little digging, if it does get bad. Now, before we jump into it, a reminder that the auction is running. For those of you who don't know, I am auctioning off the last 10 years of my work to help fund the studio setup that we're moving to. And I wanted to mention this because as of this video coming out, there is half a day left. Put your bid in for my Dragon's Horde Polymer Play Sculpture. This is one of my personal favorites. I do have to give this a shout out because it's hard to let go of. I love this piece. One of the other lots that's happening now as of the release of this video is the official final sketches for my How to Draw book, uh, Draw with Jazz of Creating Characters. 80% of it translated directly into the book cover and you can also see my other brainstorm sketches for what the cover could be like. These are part of one lot. There are nine lots up every day for the next two or three weeks. There are sign prints up for grabs too. Get involved in the fun and the insanity that is the Jazzy Auction by going to jazzyauction.com. All right, art hack time. Hack one, boom, what do we got? How to make your own stylus. One, dissect a dead pen. Uh, I don't have a dead pen, I just have, just give me a sec. All right, I've got my dead pen. May it rest in peace. <laughs> Murder a Q-tip. This is a very violent hack. <laughs> is this what you meant? Murder a Q-tip. Chopping it in the middle. Sharpen it. Insert Q-tip. Okay, put the fl floopy end out. Use leftover aluminum foil to wrap around the pen. What is the foil for? Get water. What is the water? So what? hang on. It turns into a stylus. That's the hack. You put water in this and it's a stylus. So you're telling me this janky dead pen cotton bud looking foil is now a stylus. Oh my God. What is the foil for? I'll simplify your art hack. Cotton bud, empty pen, a little bit of a, a wait. It's not working. Did the foil make it? No. Don't even. If this is what makes it work, it is? What? What? This was the worst art hack and it's really weirdly cool. What if, it, it, if without the foil, nothing, nothing. What is, what is it, what, what? I, that actually blows my mind. I have no idea why or how that. <laughs> oh but here's a, here's a question for you. Question is, does it work to draw with? <laughs> What is happening? My life is a lie. This is actually really good. It's a terribly made art hack instructional video, but you can make your own stylus with a fucking pen shell, a Q-tip and foil. Credit where credit is due. Right. Use a nail art dotting tool to indent the paper. And sketch over with a pencil and it leaves a white line. You can use this technique to draw hyper-realistic fur or hair. All right, let's give that one a crack. All right, so just doing some gentle indenting. I'm gonna shade some, see what happens in the shaded air. It's sort of clawing the paper a bit, which can't be good for it. All right, here's my uh, soft lead pencil thing. I mean, I've, I think I've done this before ages ago. It does work pretty well. In fact, yeah, with dark lead, and if you go down quite heavy, I mean, that's actually pretty good. I don't know how practical it is, but I mean, I'd consider it an okay art hack. Do we find any bad ones? Are there bad TikTok art hacks? When your pencils are getting too short to hold, in an old pen that's the right size, pull it apart and use the canister to hold your pencil. Oh, this is a problem I've got. It's my black wing, too short, getting too short. All right, let's see, let's give this a crack. Can I fit in you? Actually, yeah, quite well. All right, you're, ta you're just taping it with electrical tape? Okay, so a bit of, bit of tape, make it nice and firm. Okay, here's my Frankenstein too short pencil. And this feels pretty great. That's this it's a great that's a that's actually a really good art hack. There are no bad art hacks on TikTok. I mean you can't find them. They're there. There's probably billions. TikTok has solved bad art hacks. Surely not. We have more. I have more to get through. We can find a bad art hack. I want to know that I can find it if I want to. Don't take that away from me. Lay some paper. Paper. Put some oil on it. Dry oil. it off as much as you can. Okay, we might have found it, people. Paper, oil, so dry. 
You have tracing paper. What? No. All right. Let's do it. This one's going to be dumb. I can feel it. Oil. Spread it all around. Got my oil paper. I'm going to go put this outside in the sun to dry. So I'm going to move on to other art hacks. We'll bring that paper in when it's dry and we'll test that one out in a bit. What do we got next? For all the watercolorists out there, I'm showing you how to fix those dry, cakey watercolor tubes you buy on accident. I've come across some art hacks on TikTok before about saving your dry, cakey paint tubes. Have you guys had this problem? I've never had paint tubes dry up, but obviously if people are making this content, it's a thing. So I feel like, I don't know, to try this one, I sort of have to make dry cakey paint tubes. And watercolor paints, so I've got watercolor paint tubes. I guess I'll need to dry them out as if the tube has air leaking in or something to dry it. Oh my God, these gloves are terrible. Let's get started. I'm gonna uh, dissect my paint tubes. Let's uh, start from the bottom. Here we go. There it is, there's our watercolor tube, now exposed. I'm trying to simulate it. I have to dry out these. Heat gun. Get a turntable and a heat gun, and then all you... This is an art hack. I'm gonna record this. All right, I'm gonna record a voiceover. Do you ever want... Do you ever want to follow along with it? Fuck, this is always hard. Do you ever want to follow along with those art hacks that take, ah, and they in, it despite the, fuck, I'm just one little mistake, I have to redo the whole thing. That was really good otherwise. She had to fix your watercolor. Do you ever, have you ever wanted to follow along with those art hacks that teach you how to fix your crusty old watercolor paint, but all you have is this useless normal watercolor paint? Well, just open up your normal watercolor paint tube, grab a turntable, put a block of wood or something else to help separate the paint from the turntable, because we're going to apply some heat. And then you put, you open up uh, container thingies of watercolor paint or acrylic paint, get a stand, extend it, and clamp a heat gun to the stand aiming at the rotating paint. Now you see this way, you can create a station that dries out some of your art mediums from acrylic paints, to even oil paints, without burning the containers or wrecking the turntable. And over time, this uh, will dry it out really effectively, really fast. This can be used to dry out other things without wrecking them, uh, but it's really satisfying to watch. And as a result, you'll have nice, crusty, useless watercolor paint or acrylic paint that you can then fix. You're welcome. Perfect. This is really good. This is a really good bad TikTok art hack. This is the sort of art hack I've been hoping to see, but they're not out there. But I think people should see this. And TikTok won't let people see this. Just because I make a useless TikTok art hack doesn't mean people don't want to see it. I think we need a. I think we need to fix TikTok people. Here's how you can properly break your paint tube so you can enjoy fixing them. Hashtag art hacks. But it's not gonna. I'm not gonna. TikTok's not gonna see my art hacks. We need to stand up to this injustice. Hashtag. Jazzy hacks. It's a particularly jazzy brand of art hacks that are useless. We need to do this together. In fact, just do the same thing, right? Because in my next TikTok video, I'm gonna go through your submissions and share some of the best worst TikTok art hacks. Because by using hashtag art hacks, just in case they pick up enough traction that you get some trend and action on the actual art hacks hashtag, we can add hashtag jazzy hacks to find the best bad art hacks with each other because we're making them that we can make bad art hacks bad again that's the platform i'm running on <laughs> and on that note there are some submissions from the last time i did this that i want to check out with you guys because i did a duet challenge so let's check out the duets oh god no. that's pretty cool ah, no, stop. <laughs> <laughs> I like how some of them are like actual Stand horror, horrific, spooky, and some are just really dumb and funny. Stop! Stop! <laughs> That's awesome. That's a really cool illustration. Most of the top ones are like just really awesome illustrations. Oh my god, that's so cool! Oh, I like that glitch effect. That's a cool. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> this is really good. Oh god, no! Wow, I love that transition. Ah, oh, that is sick. Well done. That was amazing. 
Last but not for least. For some reason, drawing to show through on my nice illustrations, but... Oh, it's mine. I'm like, where's the other one? That's how long it took me to... I'm an idiot. There's so many more that I've seen and enjoyed that I can't fit in this video, obviously. Huge amount of contributions to that last one, so go check them out. But also, get involved in this next one. Make your own bad art hack, or jazzy hack, as I like to call them. Let's try a few more. I haven't lost hope. I'm showing you how to fix those dry, okay. cakey watercolor tubes you buy on accident. Okay, so dry, cakey watercolor tubes. Obviously, I had to sort of invent my own. They're still not very dry. My hack isn't all that great let's be honest but that's the hallmark of a great bad hack so first i take a little bit of honey now honey okay you don't need as much as i put here you just need a little drop just to mix in and act as a binder to the pigments all right got me a pigment binder put that in a separate little dimple now they're very soft and velvety but they go on the paper baby smooth okay so just honey just add honey to my dry cakey pigment mix it in there that does immediately rejuvenate. Don't know what it paints, okay. What about as watercolor? Does it still act like watercolor? Yes, yes it does. All right, this is a really good art hack. There's a hack for drawing poses. Go to Magic Poser Web. It's a website on posing people. You change lighting, copy and paste, and use as a reference. That's really good. That's really good. God damn it. We've won last hope. And it's waiting outside and drying in the sun. This is it, people. Salvation is here. It's a jazzy hack, hopefully. Okay, got a little, uh, got a little uh, coloring in book. And let's just see that this does not become tracing. Oh my God, that's incredible. That becomes tracing paper. What? What? There are no bad art hacks on TikTok. What is a content creator to react to? Oh my God, can I even, can I draw on it? Does it ruin it for art? Can I, no, it doesn't. I can draw on it, fine. What about paint? It's oil, it's covered in oil. Surely watercolor paint is gonna be useless on it now. Use my honeyed up, broken, fixed watercolor paint. It's actually going down pretty well. I give up, all hope is lost. Unless it isn't. Unless we combine our powers and imagination and we show those people who are looking for useful art hacks, no! Facebook got something right. And that's bad quality, can't look away from it content is as important as the stuff that's useful. And in fact, art hacks will become more valuable on TikTok when there's more crap to sift through to get to the good stuff. You don't have a platform that only serves worthwhile art hacks. <laughs> Ludicrous! Now to be fair, I delegated finding the art hacks for me to react to to my team to try and find the bad ones, but it was hard to find the bad ones. I mean, Rob's not an artist, so I guess it was under his assumption that some of those things, which I mean, it's a reasonable assumption that honey, oil, and paper would make tracing paper. They seem absurd. They all worked. They all worked. So I guess it comes down to us to fix it. Oh, before you go, by the way, I thought I'd also show you what's on auction for tomorrow. Some of you will remember my He-Man reconversion, taking the classic He-Man toy and making him epic and modern and repainting and putting them both on a diorama. This lot is up for auction tomorrow by the time this video comes out, as is Drunk Pirate Lady character design session, complete with the uh, sketches that it resulted in the final artwork and it's a piece I'm really proud of. You can tell it's the original because it's got all the bleed through of all those Copic markers. There are some hugely iconic pieces in there. Some I'm really proud of and some that are just kind of funny and were really hilarious videos on this channel. So go check out the Jazzy Auction, find your favorites and make a note to bid or grab yourself a signed print. All of my selling my original artworks and selling these signed prints and even opening up to donations, all of that is about getting as much as we can to make as much more for you as possible. To take the next level to the furthest it can go to the most intense it can be and involve as many people as we can and make it huge hit like for more content like this and so other people can see it and join in our craziness on tiktok otherwise until next time there are some videos over there you're bound to enjoy that is it for now and until next time, i said until next time so i always say it before i sign off so until next time <laughs> i'll see you later